Hello everybody, Matt here. Today I'm at Walmart. Let's see what they have for Hot Wheels. As you can see, they have pretty much nothing. So yeah, I'm not sure if they've restocked at all in the last few months. We do see this 9-pack and it's missing a car. So yeah, that's a state at this Walmart. We do see though, Hot Wheels mystery models. We also have some Hot Wheels 20-packs at least. Do see some pretty cool cars. Here's another one. Very nice. It would be nice if some of those were actually on the pegs. We'll see if they restock soon. We'll keep on looking. As you can see, pretty bare. There was a lot of these Hot Wheels Ninja Turtle cars, at least. Pretty good variety of them. Though obviously they must not be too popular. So I think these have been here for since near the beginning of the year. But I think the artwork at least looks kind of nice. We'll keep on looking. We do see the wheel trash at all monster truck there. Kind of cool. Here we see a aero blast and a turbo blast. Down the aisle more. There was Hot Wheels monster trucks, but not too many. Then they have some of the Disney and Toy Story 4 cars that have been around for months now. We do see Street Fighter. And then there was the Track Builder set right there. Then to Matchbox, and there was a better variety of these. So we'll look through them. Do you see the nice Porsche Rally? And then we see a really cool Ford Mustang convertible. This one I already have. And then here's a blue one. So not too bad. And then there was a Volkswagen Beetle convertible. It's kind of an interesting color on it. There was more Matchbox cars, including the lifted Ford Mustang. I've never seen that one before. It's a pretty cool find. There was more Mustangs and Volkswagens. Then we do see the moving parts, Renault. And then there was some Matchbox 5-packs, but not many. We do see some Matchbox super fast, though it looks like only this Volvo wagon and not any of the others. There was, well, there was the uh, older ones over there, but not too exciting. There was Matchbox working rigs. You see a couple of those. Not too bad. And then they did have at least a Ford Grand Torino Fast and Furious from the Motor City Muscle set. So that's a pretty nice find. But it was just this one car, unfortunately. Would like to see the others, especially the Ford Lightning. Really cool car, though. And down the aisle a bit more, we do see some larger scale die cast. And we do see the time machine right here. And the Ford GT. And another one. There was some Tomica up there. But then there was just trucks. Also, there was just a couple M2 cars right here. Pan Am. Kind of cool. But that was pretty much what was in the aisle. Really not too much to be excited about. I was hoping for more, but because it's still the pandemic, you know, might be a while to stores have full stock. Walking around a bit more, I did find these, which are pretty cool. These Matchbox Top Gun 5-packs. Very cool. Some nice cars in there. I looked through to see what was different between them. Looks like a couple different ones. But yeah. Thank you for watching this video. Like and subscribe for more. And have a good day. Thanks for sticking through.